Hey guys, Fred Stakeup here. Welcome back to my channel. Now let's talk about the upcoming Techno Phantom V Flip. Techno made a remarkable entrance into the affordable device scene with the unveiling of the Techno Phantom V4 during the first quarter of the year. And it seems like Techno is ready to wow us again with another affordable device. With the release of the Samsung Galaxy, z fold 5 and z flip 5 techno is trying to take advantage of the momentum and it's only wise for them to do something about it now i would say techno is trying to give samsung a bombastic side eye here bombastic side eye criminal offensive side eye if you want a slightly cheaper affordable phone right now techno is the only brand that offers something decent and worth recommending at a very reasonable price now, brace yourself for the imminent launch of a flip smartphone that might be known as either the Techno Phantom V Flip or the Phantom V Yoga. With the leaked information that is all over the internet, the model number with AD11 of the Techno Phantom V Flip series will support 5G network and offer connectivity options for 2G, 3G, 4G and 5G in addition to Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. The device is expected to utilize a dual battery configuration like most other flagship on sale today. The Techno Phantom V Flip 5G will probably consist of two batteries with capacities of 1,165 mAh and 2,735 mAh respectively. Now, comparing those numbers to what Samsung offers on the Z Flip 5 shows that the Techno Phantom V Flip will have a larger battery capacity. If you ask me, I'll say that is an intriguing feature. Meaning, the combined battery capacity of the Techno Phantom V Flip will be 3,900 mAh. Now, moving on to the display, it is rumored that the Techno Phantom V Flip 5G will have a 1.32 inches AMOLED display on the outer display, while the main display will feature a 6.9 inches AMOLED screen with a resolution of 1080 by 2640. The external display will have a resolution of 466 by 466. And just like the Phantom V Fold, it will come with a similar build quality and similar design at the rear. From the pictures that I've seen on the internet, I don't know how I feel about the design so far, but I'll keep my fingers crossed and wait till the launch. You can clearly see the ring design at the back that incorporates the cameras and a tiny display. Guys, I seriously don't know how I feel about the design right here, but do let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Now, there's no word whether or not the device will have any form of protection on the glass display something like a gorilla glass victus or any gorilla at all at least just give us some gorillas like any gorilla at all would be a welcome feature the device is expected to come in three color options which are black white and purple you know purple for the ladies for the cameras the phantom v flip will feature a dual ray camera and judging from the image here it could possibly come with a 64 megapixels main sensor and a 30 megapixels ultra wide lens on the selfie, it is rumored to come with a 32 megapixel shooter. Guys, all of these are rumors, so I would advise you to take it with a grain of salt. Now, judging from what we saw on the Techno Camera 20 series, the Phantom V Flip should have amazing capabilities when it comes to pictures. The Camera 20 Premiere takes amazing pictures, and I expect the upcoming device to follow suit. For the performance or specifications, the device is rumored to be equipped with a MediaTek Dimensity 8050 chipset which offers strong performance along with 8GB of RAM and 256GB of storage. We've seen this same processor on the Camo 20 Premiere with almost the same configuration. It's a capable processor and it makes a whole lot of sense for Techno to use the same configuration on the Phantom V Flip to help keep the price relatively low. Looking at the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 5 price, this will undercut it while still maintaining key features that one will expect from a flagship device. Now, one thing to keep in mind is that the Phantom V Flip might not support any external storage like a micro SD card. I understand that that could be a turning point for some people, but if you ask me, I would say that 256 GB of storage should be enough for most people. As standard in today's mid-range devices, the Phantom V Flip is expected to come with a USB Type-C out of the box with all the necessary accessories. This is what you don't get with any Samsung device today. I really appreciate it when brands bundle all the accessories within the box. I feel like it gives you this peace of mind that you're using original accessories like the charger to charge your brand new phone. Now let's talk about the price and release date. The Techno Phantom V Flip is likely to get its first teaser next month and launching might be towards the end of the same month which is September 2023. 
the device will be available globally but i feel like we nigerians will have it first like the boss that we are as for the price the techno phantom v flip will be priced fairly and competitively we're looking at 450 to 500 dollars depending on the configuration now if you ask me i'll say that is insanely good for affordable smartphone the z flip 5 is priced at a thousand dollars so getting this at less than the price of the z flip 5 would be super amazing and i cannot wait to get my hands on the actual device so i can put it to test so guys those are my thoughts on the upcoming techno phantom v flip that's basically what we've learned so far what we know so far and if all speculations turns out to be true this would be another hit for techno and in the end it is all the consumer that will benefit what do you think about the upcoming techno phantom v flip let's have a discussion in the comment section below and if you haven't seen my techno camera 20 premiere video click right here to go watch it now otherwise i'll be signing out and i guess i'll see you in another video bye bye